guys so I just did my first class of the day I have all online classes and I do school from home right now so my first class was at 8 a.m it's my communications class um, I'm now just gonna you know kind of get ready a little bit wash my face fix my hair and then I have a huge huge paper to write today I did all the research for it yesterday it's my ethics class it's like our last paper and then we just have a test at the end of the year and it's a nine page paper so we're gonna be writing that today I also have a marketing class to do it's asynchronous so I just do it on my own time it's just due by midnight tonight and then I have my ethics lecture today at 12 30 so I'm just gonna be bringing you guys along today um, I thought it would be kind of fun kind of see how online classes really go basically I'm a zoom university student but I actually go to the University of Kentucky um, so I will be going back there to move out of my apartment. I did basically move home already just because I wanted to be home with all of my family and the dogs and things like that. But I do have to go move out of my apartment in three or four weeks at the end of the semester, basically right after finals. So you guys will be seeing that. And next semester we are going back to in-person class. So I will be like moving back into an apartment and living there next semester. So if you guys wanna see like an apartment tour or anything like that come fall just let me know because I would be happy to do one but let's go ahead and get ready I have lots to get done today so there's no time to be lollygagging around <laughs> So I'm just going to do some super basic quick makeup and I thought I'd talk to you guys while I was doing it. Um, so like I was saying earlier, today is going to be like really busy because it's nearing like finals and everything and we have lots of assignments and like papers, projects to do. So like today is Tuesday and I have this nine page paper due on, um, what is it? Thursday at midnight and I need to get that written and then Tuesday of next week I have the final project for my communication class my strategic communication and that is like really long so I'm trying to finish this paper as soon as possible so that I can start working on the project I don't really like to be doing you know 800 different things all at once so I'm trying to finish one and like be able to check it off the list and then move on to the next one and then next week after that week is over we go into dead week and then finals so the semester is like really close to being over um so it's basically just like power through it because it's a lot right now and I also um tutor and nanny quite a bit so like today I tutor from 4 30 to 5 30 so it's not very much but that one's just like in my neighborhood but on Wednesday Thursday and Friday this week I'm nannying and tutoring for seven hours each day so that's like really busy so I need to finish that paper today so this weekend and like the little bit of time I do have those days I can work on that project because it's like a creative project like we've been working with the same brand for like the whole semester and now we have to do like our final thing of like how we're going to promote the brand so I have to um you know like put a lot of thought into that and I need to have my brain like focused on one thing so hopefully I'll get that paper finished today and then I have my marketing to do um so that usually takes me like an hour it's an assignment I'm grabbing a brush it's an assignment with a lecture so like we do the lecture video that's asynchronous and then we have like a quiz at the end of it like it's like five or six questions and then there's like an assignment afterwards that like goes with what we learned and it's usually like either a video or um like a little quiz thing um but I have to get all that done and then we have so the paper I'm writing is for ethics um, it's like a requirement for my degree to take this ethics class and it's my last like non-major or minor class and that 
is at 12.30, so it's like 10 right now. It is 9.48, so I have like two and a half hours. Um, so I'm gonna try to get my makeup done, fix my hair a little bit, and then probably start writing that paper. And then I'll have my lecture. After that, I'll probably do the marketing assignment. And then if I still have time, I'll work on my paper more before I go work. And then after I get back from tutoring, I will finish up the paper, hopefully. So fingers crossed we finish that. You guys, like, pray for me. It's going to be a rough one this week. Um, but I'm just using my Marc Jacobs bronzer. I love this stuff. Um, but yeah, if you guys have questions, like, about my major or anything like that, feel free to leave them in the comments down below. I'd be happy to answer them. I'm going to be going into my senior year at UK next semester and it's stressing me out. I'm not ready to graduate yet. So I'm trying to save up a bunch of money because you know, once you graduate, you're like a full adult. Like you have responsibilities more than you ever have. So I'm working like a ton right now, especially for being a full-time student. Um, I'm trying to work as much as possible and then this summer I'm taking a summer course so that I can graduate early um, And I'm also working like four days a week, too So it's gonna be a lot, but if you guys can see behind me like my room This is actually getting redone at the beginning of summer. So like a couple weeks after I get back from moving out of my apartment, I'm going to be doing a complete overhaul of my room. All the furniture is getting like moved around. I'm not replacing any of the furniture with the exception of my desk chair. Um, but I am like redoing the decorations. I'm cleaning out my closet, all of that kind of stuff. So it's definitely going to be interesting. It's going to be a lot of work, but if you guys want to see that, be sure you click the subscribe button. Um, because I don't want you guys to miss out. It's going to be a fun time. And then at the end, I'm going to do a big room tour and show you guys all of my organization, all that kind of stuff. And I think it's going to be really fun. So definitely, um, hit that subscribe button if you are looking forward to seeing that so that you will be aware when that gets posted. Um, okay. If you guys watched my um, makeup clean out, you guys can probably see it up in the eye. I think it's on that side. Um, I talked about the Becca highlighters and how I'm sad that they're going out of business. I'm so close to finishing my little tiny one and it's like crumbling and it makes me sad. But I have a big one left and then I'll really be sad when I finish that one because I won't be able to rebuy it anymore. You guys should let me know in the comments, are you guys in school, are you in high school, college, where do you go to college? I love talking with you guys, so like when you leave me comments, it makes me happy. So don't be shy, like feel free to chat with me in the comments. I respond to absolutely everyone, so feel free to leave a comment and we can chat. It's really fun. I've had a few of you um, tell me that you're going to UK in the fall and that's super exciting. You're going to love it. And especially because we're going back to in-person class. So you guys are really lucky that you're avoiding all of the online college craziness that's been happening. Sorry, my dog is growling in the background. That's Nala up there. She's growling at people walking their dogs. Um, cause she's a drama queen and can't handle another dog near her that she doesn't know. Um, but it's super exciting to be going back to in-person in the fall. And I'm also going to have new roommates, so I'm moving. Um, one of my roommates is graduating, and one of them said she's going to be living off campus. So I'm living with completely new roommates, so hopefully that goes well. I'll have to kind of update you guys on that situation when it, you know, comes. But there's lots of fun stuff planned for this summer. I'm, like, really excited. The room tour and, like, renovation thing being a big part of it. So, definitely stick around for that. But we're also doing tons and tons of other fun stuff. So, feel free to stick around. Also, I'm wearing my boyfriend's sweatshirt. So, that's why it looks so giant on me. It's just really comfortable and I like to sleep in it. Also, I heard from some of you guys um, on my last, not my last video, but the one before the, that one. That it was, like, my makeup video. That you guys want to see a makeup tutorial. So, I will be doing, like more of an in-depth like everyday college makeup routine type of thing for you guys it's like my super basic makeup that i do all the time and then if that goes well 
maybe I'll do some more that are like, oh, college night out or like date night makeup and stuff like that. But we're gonna start with the basics because that's what I do like 99% of the time. And I don't really have anywhere to go wearing fancy makeup right now because it's like nearing finals and my life is revolving around work and school right now. For breakfast, I'm just drinking a breakfast essential shake. I always take the little packaging off. They're just chocolate and they're like the high protein ones. But I just drink these most of the mornings, especially if I'm not going to like fix breakfast. This is an easy way to get like some decent nutrition. But now I'm just going to fix my hair. I think I'm just going to um, like half up it today just to get it out of my face. So I have a comb and a brush. And I'm probably just going to pull like this much. And just tie it up in the back. Make it really easy today. Because I don't have time for all this. Also, I'm staring down at my freaking vanity drawer. And it is so full of stuff that I don't even need. I'm like so excited to do this clean out thing because it's going to be so much more organized, you guys. It's going to be so much easier to keep up with all of my stuff and I'm going to have way less stuff. I'm not a minimalist in any way. Like I can't. I have too much stuff to ever do that, but it's going to be a lot better. So that'll be fun, but I'm going to go ahead and get off here, do some of my school and I'll get, like, keep you guys posted on how it's going. Pray for me. I need some help. Alright guys, so it's like noon-ish now. And I'm like a page and a half into my paper. I did a little bit more, like research and the articles that we had to use and then ate some lunch and now I'm about to go into my 12:30 class pretty soon so I figured I would give you guys a nice little update and I'm going to continue to be working on my paper up until we get into class and then I'll give you guys a couple of like snippets of what the class looks like it's mostly like a discussion based class um we usually do like group discussions talking about like whatever topic we're talking about that week so like last week it was about like being a parent and like the responsibilities that you have to your children and stuff like that and that's part of what I'm writing my paper about is like whether it's positive or negative to be a child like the advantages and disadvantages and like the responsibilities that you have to your children and stuff like that so it was an interesting class last week and then not really sure what we're gonna be talking about this week but hopefully it's interesting because some of the topics have been pretty boring but last week was pretty cool so hopefully it's a good topic this week but i will keep you guys updated on that Alright guys, so it's a little while later now. It's like 3 o'clock. We had our class and it ran a little bit long actually. But it's been over for about 45 minutes and I've been working on my paper again. I'm going to show you guys kind of what I have done. It's like two and a half pages finished out of like the seven or eight that I need to write. So we're getting somewhere but it definitely feels like it's taking forever. But I'll go ahead and show you guys kind of my setup that I have going on. So I have the notes that I took over here from the articles and I just have them like in a notes page on my laptop. I have a ton because they were two 20 plus page articles so I have lots of information. And then behind my actual paper I have the questions that we need to answer during the article. So we have five different questions um, all about the two articles and then down here I have my paper. So I have the whole first page this whole second page done and then I'm like getting close to the end of the third page so we're almost finished with three out of like seven to eight pages. I'm gonna work on this until I need to go to my tutoring job which is just down the street um, but that's at 4 30 so I'm gonna spend the next hour and a half ish. I do have to like change clothes and everything before I go over there so probably like an hour and 15 minutes writing this. Hopefully I can get like through the fifth page maybe finish two more pages before I have to go. And then whenever I get back, we'll most likely be eating dinner, which I can show you guys what we have if we have anything interesting. Um, and then I'll have to do my marketing class, like 
asynchronous thing that's due at midnight and then hopefully finish out the paper. I'll also be taking a bath so I can show you guys what I use um, in the bath slash shower. I'm probably going to do like an uh, in-depth one with like hair mask and all that kind of stuff because lord knows I'm freaking stressed out right now and then I might self tan afterwards. I got this new self tanning mousse foam thing that I'll show you guys too. I've used it one time and it went pretty well so hopefully it goes good again. Last time the only thing I had trouble with was the back of my hands like didn't get the right color. So I need to order one of those like tanning mitts. I just haven't yet. So hopefully it goes well again this time. But I'll keep you guys in the loop on everything that's happening. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and work on the paper. And then I'll update you guys right before I leave for tutoring. Okay guys, so there was actually a delivery that just happened for Dixie's subscription box to Pup Box. So I'm going to show you guys what she got and give her some of the stuff because she's going to be really cute. And some of the stuff in here I'm sure is going to be pretty cool. So let me just go ahead and open it up and then I'll show you guys. Okay, so this is what the inside of the box looks like whenever we opened it up. So the first thing in here is these teeth treat things. I think they're supposed to be like for keeping her teeth clean and like for keeping her breath from stinking. So that's pretty cool. And then there's a thing of treats in here. Oh, they have a little pig on the front. And they're just some hard treats and I'm sure she'll love them. She loves treats so she gets in these. Um, and then there's a couple of toys down in here. So there's this one, which I think is supposed to be a, like a flying pig, which is pretty funny. Um, and it has a squeaker in it. When we um, finish, I'll take off the tag and give it to her. Um, and then this is a dog toothpaste, I'm pretty sure. Um, but you don't have to actually brush their teeth. You just stick it on their teeth and they like kind of keep it in their mouth and end up swallowing it so that's pretty cool and then there's this rope with a ball on the end and I think she'll like this a lot she likes playing tug of war so super cool but I'm gonna go ahead and take the packaging off this one and give it to her okay girls you want the toy oh Dixie wants the toy oh Melody wants it too go. <laughs> Dixie you got a toy she likes the toy you guys it's Dixie approved Highly recommend the pup boxes. She loves them every single time. She gets so excited. And it keeps me from having to, you know, go hunting for dog supplies because it gets delivered right to the door. Dixie approved. <laughs> Alright guys, so it's now like 420. I went ahead and changed clothes. So I just have this Kentucky shirt on um, and then some Nike shorts. Um, I'm heading over to go tutor. I was able to finish through the five pages that I wanted to get done um, of the paper before I left. And then when I get back, I have pages six and seven to do, and then it should be able to be done. I feel pretty close to wrapping it up. I just have like one and a half more questions to answer and then do a conclusion and then it will be finished. So that shouldn't take super long whenever I get back. And then we'll be having dinner and I have, um, Sona credits if you guys know what that is it's basically like I'm in a psych class so we have to get research um we have to be involved in research experiments and I have to complete a few of those tonight and then I also need to do my marketing assignments um and then maybe I'll have time to do some fun things before I have to go to bed um college during close to finals week is pretty hectic and a bit rough but we're surviving and hopefully we're able to do a little bit of fun stuff tonight before going to bed. I have been watching um, Big Brother. If you guys have seen my 40 Facts About Me video, I'll put it up here. Um, you guys know that I love Big Brother and that I really want to be on it one day. Next year I'm going to apply for the first time because you have to be 21. Um, so I've been watching like episodes of that while I've been writing my paper. I know probably not the most productive thing, but I'm bored and I need something to watch. So I've been watching that in the background while I've been doing my paper writing. But with that being said, I'm going to go hop in my car, drive down the street and do this tutoring for an hour. And then I will talk to you guys when I get back. All right guys, so I just made it back from tutoring. It went pretty well. Um, it's like 5.30 now. I'm going to go ahead and get started finishing up my paper and then hopefully the next time I talk to you guys, it will be finished because I only have like two pages left to go and I'm hoping to finish it before dinner time. So I'll talk to you guys then. Y'all, my paper's done. 
finally. And I've had dinner. And now I'm about to go run a bath. I'm already in the bathroom and I'm going to show you guys what I use in the bath and then the stuff that I'm using afterwards. I really need this because I'm so dead after all this paper writing. I literally feel like death. So let's go um, run this bath and get a little relaxed and done. I'm also going to prop my computer up on the toilet and watch um, more Big Brother like I told you guys I was watching earlier. So we'll be doing all of that. guys I just finished up that marketing assignment that I needed to do I'm sorry if this was not the most entertaining vlog in the world um, it was very hectic me trying to do school all day I literally feel like I'm about to pass out I'm so tired Dixie's well on her way to being asleep too so we're probably just going to do a little bit of puppy cuddling and then head off to bed because I'm so tired I could literally fall over and go to sleep right now um, but I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, if you enjoyed the content and want to see more from me, feel free to hit that subscribe button. We today passed the 75 subscriber mark, which is so exciting. And if you guys want to help me, um, to reach my 100 subscribers by the end of April goal, then hit that subscribe button and also turn on the post notification bell. So you don't miss my future uploads because there's lots of fun content coming, especially after school is over with for the year. I cannot wait to not be stressed 24-7 this summer. Um, so with that being said, um, just feel free to leave a like on the video or sub and subscribe and turn on the post notification bell. And I will see you all next time. Bye guys.